ever considered why some of the wealthiest people are against wearing premium brands. Contrary to popular belief, wealthy individuals choose stylish yet comfortable alternatives to luxury for a number of reasons. In this video, we're going to enter into the intriguing world of upscale fashion and discover why wealthy individuals don't necessarily use expensive goods to show off their social standing and wealth. Their choices in clothing are influenced by a multitude of factors, ranging from their impression of affluence to the importance placed on comfort and quality. Who can recall the Disney film Blank Check from the 1990s? A youngster is given a blank check to fill out with the amount of compensation he believes is fair after being hit by a car unintentionally. He chooses to go for one million dollars, and to his amazement, the bank gives him the money without any questions asked. Sadly, the one million dollars did not last forever, and eventually, the youngster ran out of money. This tells us all a very important lesson. If you aren't taking care of something, any size of wealth will decline. This story may have nothing to do with Mark Zuckerberg, Bill Gates, or the world's wealthiest men, but its lesson explains why they don't spend a lot of money on unnecessary things. The world's wealthiest billionaires and millionaires could certainly afford to splurge on designer clothing, yet they choose not to. They understand that it is an unnecessary expense. Ultimately, wearing high-end brands won't accelerate them to success or elevate the quality of their work. Premium labels target 1% of people with a net worth above $10 million. Surprisingly though, those who purchase the greatest luxury products are not those with the greatest wealth. Actually, statistics indicate that the majority of buyers of luxury goods are members of the middle class, with a typical income of about $60,000. To express their status, taste and ambitions, they are prepared to spend extensively on expensive goods, even if doing so means forgoing other necessities or incurring debt. Wealth-related symbols. Even though luxury labels are frequently linked to money, wealthy individuals understand that symbols of wealth go far beyond apparel and accessories. They realize that relationships, knowledge and experiences are more valuable than material belongings when it comes to true prosperity. Through their emphasis on these intangible elements, they exhibit a more sophisticated comprehension of wealth. The way wealth is looked. Rich people don't wear luxuries in parties because they don't want to come out as ostentatious. They are aware that showing off pricey designer labels can draw unwelcome attention and give the impression that one is wealthy. Rather, wealthy people tend to use more subdued and discreet ways to display their position. Wearing fancy clothes is all about the status of the middle class. Wearing something branded, pricey, and unique is the key to showcasing ambitions, achievement, and good taste. It increases self-esteem and serves as a signal to others of one's uniqueness or sense of being part of something. To put it simply, dressing for other people rather than oneself is crucial. However, the wealthy, especially those in the uppermost 1%, have a rather different take on luxury fashion. Their anticipation of embracing something unique and mysterious is what draws them in. Distaste for logo-obsessed culture Many rich people consider the heavy branding that is frequently present on luxury goods to be inflated and unneeded. Rather than emphasizing extravagant logos, these people choose to concentrate on the inherent worth of their apparel, placing a higher priority on design, craftsmanship, and quality. Rich people use clothing for more reasons than just flaunting their money or status. It's a means for them to express themselves and show off their own tastes and styles. They know that being stylish is more than just showing off brand labels or the newest fashions. This explains why billionaires avoid purchasing designer clothing. Gates famously wears a Casio watch, which costs less than $100, demonstrating how little money he spends on clothing and accessories. There is another example like Steve Jobs, who wore the exact same New Balance sneakers for years, and other celebrities like Warren Buffett and Mark Zuckerberg also take the same footsteps. How come they aren't investing more? Billionaires know that money isn't something that lasts forever, so they avoid paying for a lot of things. They are aware that not everything matters so much, and that a lot of labor goes into obtaining wealth. Not that you can't afford luxury items, instead, it's possible that you could choose your purchases more wisely. What then should you do? According to the website CNBC Make It, Zuckerberg sticks to the fundamentals to create a uniform style which makes his life easier by reducing the number of morning decisions he has to make and enables him to concentrate on his work and the important things. Gates is all about efficiency and practicality, which is why he wears button-down shirts, 
jumpers and chinos, along with his Casio watches. Buffett taught him that you don't actually need much to stay productive or to dress nicely and comfortably. Repetition is the key. To make the most of your wardrobe and avoid wasting money, all you have to do is keep wearing the clothes you already own in new mixes. Many billionaires and millionaires maintain their wealth by leading simple, austere lives. Dressing simply can help with this. You don't actually need an expensive shirt to improve your profession or enrich your personal life, although it is a wonderful luxury and can make your experience great. In any case, you can find excellent choices at fair costs to help you control your finances more effectively. Furthermore, since clothing is an inescapable expense, many billionaires view pricey options as pointless since you will eventually need to replace them. They focus on much more necessary stuff to find fulfillment rather than unnecessary spending. What do you think about their view? Could it be a true statement or an untrue statement? Comment your thoughts in the comment section 